Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be unboxing a lot of Furby mail. For the past few weeks, I've been treating myself and bought a bunch of random Furby items online. So first off, we have this super rare piece, but let's start off with the cute stickers. I love getting stickers with my packages. If you see the background of my videos, I usually have stickers in them and those come from packages. Oh, and so this item here is extremely rare and I'm so happy to own it. This is a pillowcase. It's a Furby pillowcase. It has such a beautiful design. It's extremely large. You can tell it has had some wear. I'm pretty sure it has been used. But it fits like a standard pillow size. It's massive and it has six different Furbies in it. And it looks so adorable. I can't help myself but I'm going to use that as a background for the rest of the video. Next, we have this cute little thank you note that comes with our patch. This is a custom made patch that I picked up in Mercari. I'll go ahead and put the seller's information on the side so you can visit them because they do make them to order. At least they, they were nice enough to do that for me. Next, oops, sorry, <laughs> I got too excited. Um, I think this one's also from eBay and it looks like it's a makeshift box they didn't really have the size that they needed so they just cut paste and placed and that's okay we do that and as long as a cute little item is saved and so i did uh, order this super adorable shelby he is a little damaged his um little antennas have come unplugged there's some paint damage from him leaning into something so we're gonna have to restore him we also need to clean him up but apart from that, he looks really good. And I actually got him for less than the selling price. So I'm excited for that. Okay, so I'm really excited about this one. Like we saw the other two and I was very excited about those. But this one is something I've been waiting for. It's something that is really hard to get your hands on at a pretty fair price. And I was lucky enough that one of our Furby friends was actually selling it as they were cleaning out their um their collection and they had three items that they were selling i wanted to buy all three but i could only choose one because my budget was a little tight but look they still make it through. thank you now oh thank you so much for your purchase and i hope you enjoy these stickers of course i will totally enjoy these stickers after the video i'm going to be placing them all like on my background to see where they'll belong best so this is what i bought from them. <sighs> I'm so excited because this is another Furby backpack. This is an embroidered Furby backpack. So unlike the other Furby backpacks that have the plastic base, this one has a beautiful embroidery. The fur doesn't go all the way around, so the zipper doesn't jam as much with the fur. So they have created this little patch area where there's fabric. The zipper is very small compared to the rest of the bag, but it's honestly stunning. And although I can't promise that I won't wear him, <laughs> because I'm pretty sure I will, I'll be extremely careful with him. Next up, we have this item that I bought off of eBay. And well, it was one of those midnight impulsive purchases where you're just like doom scrolling. And then you see something that you're like, I've been meaning to add this to my collection for the past couple of years. And well, what better time than now? <laughs> And honestly, the seller did a great job. They packed it up so well. It's so nicely and tightly wrapped, but it is a little challenging because now I have to go through like all the layers of bubble wrap without damaging the item, but still trying to get it out as safely as possible. <laughs> and it's really hard to be careful because I really want to see it. <laughs> I'm excited. Come on. <laughs> I really did struggle through this one and I had to like speed up. <laughs> I had to speed up the footage because it was, it was a struggle. It was like a very careful operation. <laughs> oh my gosh, finally, after all the hard work, we were able to get this guy out. Oh my goodness. And he's so adorable. I love the colors. He's the baby blue and pastel pink color Furby. He kind of takes after that little baby Furby. And the bottom of his face is open. I'm hoping that it is supposed to be like that. Because if it's missing something, I'll just have to repurchase another one that has one as well. But this one is going like this, straight like this, into my collection. And with that, we go ahead and move into a little bit more traditional Furby packages. This guy also picked up off eBay. I'll put the image of the listing on the side. And this guy, I actually got him at a really good price. I've been looking for him because I didn't have one in my collection in the past. I believe this is a Snow Leopard Furby. 
And they packed him with a little, little worms. <gasps> and a thank you note. Let me see, let me see, let me see. Oh, look at this baby. He's so cute. Look at his eyes. Oh, look at those beautiful blue eyes. The only thing about this guy is that he's slightly dirty, but that's okay. His tag has a lot of wear. Um, but th th there's no discoloration on his purple tag. <gasps> and he gave us more stickers. So we're going to be keeping the stickers and we're going to be adding them to our background as well. And I also will be keeping the thank you sticky note. I swear I'm not a hoarder, guys. <laughs> and with that, we move on to our very last package. This package came from Goodwill, Illinois. I got him from Shop Goodwill in an auction. And although he's a little grimy, I'm very pleased to say that nobody bid for him except for me. <laughs> and they packed him with tons of worms. So he had some food for the road. And this is a beautiful elephant Furby. He's actually in pretty good condition. He looked dirtier in the post. I guess it was the light that made him look bad. But he actually looks pretty good. And he smells delicious. <laughs> he smells super sweet. He honestly smells like... Um, cotton candy. I don't know why he smells so good. He's a little dirty, but he smells really good. I guess this is just a really sweet boy. <laughs> and with that, we have unboxed a bunch of Furby items today. Some really rare ones, honestly. But I'm so happy that they're finally home with me. And let's put those stickers on our wall. We do need a little red in our wall. So this will go right here under the Astro Bay Zero sticker. And our Knuckles <laughs> sticker will go right under the Bambi Raptor sticker. This other one is going to go right in between Mr. Bones and uh, Deku. And we did get a bunch of kitty cat stickers. I will be keeping some again to be like works of art in a Barbie house. You know exactly which ones, all the rectangular ones. And I will be putting this kitty cat under our Barbie sticker. And with that, we're all done. Thanks for sticking around, everybody. And we'll see you again next time. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye!